now we are going to show you how to install the wide feed of the laser welder so first we take it out from the box and then here there's two cable one for the power cable another for the for the wide feeding wide feeding actually it's a wide feeding and uh, there's four pin and five pin Five pin is to, to connect to the machine and four pin connect to the feeder. <clears throat> the five pin socket on the back of the machine as we show you in the first video. And then we connect the the pipe of the Wife feeder. Release the press, do press. Uh, release the screws. Then we connect the brass head of the Y feeding pipe and lock it. Take uh, the steel wine and put it into the feeder. Uh, we need to take it. The, take the release this, the nozzle of the wine feeder away first before we put uh, install the wine. There's a different diameter. You need to find out the uh, exact diameter. Same your like your wife, the the what your wife. Uh, zero point eight, one one point zero, one point two, one point six, one point eight, and two point zero. There's a different diameter. You need to match the nozzle. Put the Y under the under the hole. There's a gap. Uh, you need to put the Y in the gap and then press the bar. The handle. Press the handle. And manually press the feeding button to feed the Y. Okay. And we need to install the nozzle of the Y feeder and then connect to the laser head. First we need to take it take the screw away, release the screws and then put it up. We use the first hole, the, f the first one, the first hole. Make it tight, and then make sure the red light, the, the Y is in the center of the red light. And then we start well, press the password, 518 enter and we enable the laser enable laser working and we need to get the signal cable back to here to connect to the piece it's just like the normal welding machine we have to connect the welding uh, clamp signal clamp to the welding piece or the ta welding table it should be connected, otherwise the machine, the welding is not enabled. It's not enabled. And we need to make sure the gas, the gas is connected. The gas pipe uh, without connect. So we need to connect the gas pipe to the machine to make sure the machine working with the gas assistant welding. And then we go to test again, press the trigger, and have a try. Oh, we found it, the power is uh, 
a little bit higher. So we just uh, decrease the power a little bit. Okay, and let's try once again. Wow, that seems not so good. And the power need to in increase a bit. Yeah, that's working. But we found the feeding speed of the Y is not so ma matchable with the welding speed. So we increase the increase the speed on the uh, Y feeder. Let's make it up to thirty. Okay. Let's get one more try. Okay, this is cool. 